call. Call someone. No, don't cook. <sighs> oh my god. Hey besties and welcome back to the Nightmare Legacy Challenge. I'm so happy to have you. Now, the last episode, we stepped away from some gameplay and we just focused on renovating. Uh, can you even call it renovating when it was just kind of adding in decor and furniture? But we completed our house a little bit more and we now have like a full kind of entrance, dining room, kitchen. Look at how cute the kitchen is. More stuff to Little Willow's office and not too much in there. Upstairs didn't really add much to the kids' rooms except this little dresser in Indigo's room. Added kind of a whole almost closet space for Willow because I thought with her job, she's probably a little bit chaotic with her clothes. She just kind of gives me that vibe and would have a lot of clothes. So I put more clothes everywhere, kind of spilling out into the hall here as well. Added some things out here and also finally gave them a nice ensuite bathroom which with a really cool walk-in shower with double showers double sinks didn't touch the kids bathroom at all which i'm realizing i maybe should have prioritized because they don't even have a mirror in there but do you know what it's fine we will make more money today and we can always add stuff i also really did want to add stuff to the outside there's not even one item out here not even like a potted plant or a chair but we're not going to worry about that right now so we're back with our fam jam. Let's press play, see what's going on. Yeah, everyone is very uncomfortable. It's 11 p.m. I'm not sure why you're intent. Oh yeah, okay, yeah. No, we're not gonna worry about that. Mod jealous. Okay, so she is a jealous sim. We did know that. Oh, Indigo, good job, baby. But she, I don't think that was anything specific that caused that. I think she's just kind of feeling jealous. So that's fine. We'll let her work through her feelings. It's Saturday. I think she's going to have her baby like tonight, like in the middle of the night, early morning. So that's very exciting. And then guys, probably shortly, I don't know if we're going to have another kid because I really want to like spin the wheel for our next heir because this is already episode, if we count the renovation episode, this is episode 14. Like that's kind of insane. 14 of Willow's generation, right? Season two, I guess you could say. So I don't know if we should have any more kids because I really just want to spin the wheel and figure out who our next heir is. No, why are you? Wash hands. I'm sorry. What's wrong with this sink? Is that not the exact same? Sink? Oh, I have the same s What? You are so annoying. Okay, that's a bathroom sink. I need to like specify all these. Bathroom sink. This is the, yep, kitchen sink. <gasps> Gone into labor. Oh my God, pause, pause, pause. I, I haven't finished with the sinks. These sinks, bathroom, bathroom. Okay, okay. We're going to labor earlier than I thought. I thought it was gonna be like five in the morning, but nope. Okay, why does she always do this? She goes into labor and then she goes to bed. No, okay, I'm getting her up and I'm finally actually sending her to the hospital because I never actually do that. Have baby at hospital. Join? Um, I don't know if I wanna go with her, but you know what? We haven't done that yet this gen, so let's go. Our first baby with Duck, our new husband. Let's freaking go. Oh, okay, Duck is freaking out. It's all good though, Duck, don't worry. He. I was gonna say, does he have kids? But he does have, remember one kid that's the same age as Indigo? Uh, check in, let's go. <laughs> Come on, bestie, I know you're miserable, but all your needs are gonna be fully up, or they better be uh, by the time we head out of here. Hey, Duck, do you wanna, where is he? Duck, come here. That's not, oh. Okay, we are extremely tired. Oh, there's Duck. Babes, babes, you gotta get up. Watch stars, we don't have time to watch stars. You gotta check in. Come on, babes, there's a lineup of people. You're kind of holding everyone up and it is freezing in here. Can we like get a thermostat, stat? I think our receptionist is evil. There we go, okay, we're up. All right, sweetie, I know. I know, life sucks, let's go. All right, we are on the move. I repeat, we are on the move, ready to give birth. Look at her in her little heels. She don't play around. Duck, where did Duck go again? Duck, get over here. Hello, I can't, oh, there we go. Hello? <laughs> he's sitting down, he has to pee. Uh, he's gonna go, what is he doing? He, do you know what, forget him. We can do this, we're a strong independent woman. We can give birth of our own accord. We've done it twice before. Here she goes, bestie's looking not super thrilled. What is it gonna be? What do you guys think? I literally have not a clue whether it's gonna be a girl or a boy. Make your predictions now. 
Oh, that's good. Yeah. All right, come on. See, look at yes, her needs. Oh, it's a girl. Oh my god, I just realized our first generation we had a boy, girl, girl. Like Oakley, Daisy, Willow. This generation we have a boy, girl, girl. What the heck? Okay, I need back to back to blue names. I should really be prepared for this. I knew this was happening. Okay, so they're all the same ones that I've said uh, for each of the babies. Mm, I don't know, like Indigo, that's probably my favorite one. Sapphire, some of these are so interesting. Like how, I don't know how these are blue. Like Nilam, Auli, like I don't wanna choose one like that only because I will not be pronouncing it correctly. Like I just know I won't be, even if it sounds really nice. Ooh, Teal, Afina, Nilima, Tila. Azura. Hmm, Azura is kind of cool. Or Azur. Azur. Azur is kind of a cool girl's name. Azur. Like this. Azur Adams. No, no, actually. It's actually Azur Moon. Okay, that, I kind of like it. Azur Moon. And I like how Azur could be a boy or a girl name. I like how it's not obviously a girl name. All right, looks like just one baby again. Are we ever going to have twins? Like, I want twins at some point. My boyfriend just put this little candle over there. He lit it. It was, here, I'll go here. It was on this thing, like right behind my mic. And he's like, can you see it? I'm like, mm, no. So, and it smells very nice. It's like aromatherapy. Lavender and cedar wood. So it's smelling, it's smelling real nice in here right now. All right, anyways, we just had a baby named Azur Moon. Oh, look at her. Right back into her shorts and tank in the middle of winter. She's like, I just had a baby. I deserve to wear this. And girl, you are so right. What the hell was that? Oh, what? Is that because we threw 10 social events? New Year's was successful. Awful. Oh, well, she was kind of a New Year's Eve baby. Or a New Year's baby. Cute. Aww. Oh, Willow's sentiments about Azur whole heart. What a bliss his new baby brings to Willow's life. Oh, that's so cute. I love how she loves her family and her bubba's. Oh, I guess we're going home. Minor Mansion, that's the name of our house. Duck was playing video games. I'm not sure when or where he was doing that, but okay. Oh yeah, I mentioned in the last video, in case you didn't watch the renovation video, yeah. Um, Oakley died. You guys let me know in the last gameplay video that I missed that. Don't know how I did, but Oakley is dead. And I'm very sad about it. Everyone is dying and it's not cool or okay. I know we're in short lifespan, but it will never be okay, okay? Okay, we're eating. Why isn't your, what? All of her stuff was all the way up and now it's not anymore. First of all, change out of this gown you would change your clothes into literally this cute outfit and then you put the gown back on to go home <laughs> explain that hey cobalt how are you doing buddy all of our kids are beautiful and gorgeous and amazing and i love them all huh? okay so what did we get look at that throw 10 social events we just need oh my god attend 15 social events we just need one so more cool. guys <laughs> and then oh. i'm pretty sure our yeah and then our whole aspiration is done oh my god we'll be able to check off one Floy whole thing oh, for yeah, her yeah. challenge all right um so actually where's our baby oh she's up here oh that's such a cute bassinet oh also i didn't really think this through where is she going to go so i'll have her share with indigo look at her playing with her new toy what a bubba i'll definitely have her share with indigo but their room is also the smallest like cobalt has a pretty decent room maybe when they get a little bit older i'll have them switch so the girls have this bigger room and cobalt can have the smaller one i think that will be fair we can also always add on actually we can also always add on like a basement or add on like a room somewhere yeah maybe we'll do that instead but for now, let's put the little bubby, I guess, in here. Or mm, I kind of like the idea of having them in our room until they're an infant. And then we can move her in with her big sisto. So cute. I also realized I forgot to give this little munchkin one of these. She's actually been really good and hasn't really woken up with like monsters or anything, but I'm still gonna pop one in here just to be safe. Perf, all right, we're saved. Okay, so it's 3.42 a.m. and everyone is awake except for Duck. 
It's Sunday. Oh wait, it's Sunday. Okay, so it is still the weekend, but also it's 4 a.m. So let's everyone go to sleep. No, don't go downstairs. Oh God, no. What's gonna take so long? You're too scared. Okay. Well, what if we weren't though? What if we just like went to bed? Okay, she will go to sleep now. Please, Indigo. Oh, and you're dirty. Your diaper's dirty. And you're a little bit hungry. But do you know what? We'll deal with that when it is a pressing issue. Good girl. She's going into bed. Okay, and as that happens, Azur is now crying. To be fair, we haven't fed her yet. So, you know, that might be good to do. Hello, I'm trying to feed her. Oh my god. Finally. It took her so long to feed her. It's springtime now, if you'll believe it. No, okay, the little munchkin is up. Uh, okay, just go pee, go pee. I will take care of Indigo. Indigo, come with me into the kitchen. I don't actually know if there's anything in here. Oh, there is. Oh, yeah, no, it's good. Indigo, come down. Grab yourself a piece of that. Okay, so it's Sunday, I believe. Yeah, so our, our new weekend since our promotion is Sunday, Monday. So we don't work again until Tuesday, but that's okay because we have a few traits no, a few skills that we need to increase. So writing, charisma, and painting. Shouldn't be too difficult looking at that, but judging on the past, you know, you can never really speak too soon. Oh, Bestie's feeling herself. Good for you. All right, I'm just gonna get her to work on her writing skill right now. Um, write. I find just practicing writing is easiest, so I'll get her going there and I can take care of the little babies. Perf. Both kids are eating. We're all happy. Oh, look, she's, oh, is she gonna come in here and sit on her chair? Okay, that's cute. As long as, Indigo, you don't talk to mommy. She's focusing. Sit there quietly, eat your food, and all will be good. Finally waking Duck up at 12 p.m. He's been sleeping three times as long as anyone else. I'm gonna get him to come and change little Indy's diapy while mommy works. Look at how far away she is from the next skill level. Like, we're gonna be here all day. Uh-oh. Do they not? Oh, okay. I don't know if they like each other very much. Oh, it's almost Indigo's birthday. Oh yeah, don't we have like three birthdays today? That's gonna be chaos. Are you going to change your diaper? Oh, oh, I think he's like gonna go actually use the change, change, change table. Changing table? Yeah, Oh, isn't that cute? New daddy. It's really dark in here. Mm. Pause everything. Hello? You want to join fam jam. Who are you? Deny. And it's Azur's birthday. I, oh, hello child. What are you doing on the balcony? Absolutely zero things out here. Oh God, I fell off. I fell, hello, baby, child. Where are you, there you are. Why are you out here? You're pooping. Did we not just change your diaper? Not even five minutes ago. And now you've come out here to poop to the world. Hello? Wait, who is this guy? I wanted to ask you if I should get to know Scarlet Elderberry. I honestly don't care. Okay, little Azur, let's take a look at this. So today, we have two birthdays. Oh my God. Is Cobalt gonna be a teenager today? Cobalt and Azur's birthdays are t today. And then tomorrow is Indigo's birthday. That's so crazy. And then our birthday is in two weeks. That's actually pretty good, not gonna lie. All right, lots of birthdays. Why is there a diaper in here? No, 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 no. Where do I put it? Oh no, I don't have a garbage up here. I feel like this is kind of taking forever. We're still mourning pet. Oh, I thought we were mourning maybe Oakley, but no, we're still mourning Blueberry. Okay, well, I'm probably gonna have to stop her so we can have our double birthday party. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop her now and then throw our little parte. Actually, no, I'm gonna bake the cake first for the first time ever, and then we're gonna throw a party. The most expensive birthday cake is the blue confetti cake. Oh, I think that's fitting, so let's make that. Duck just reached level, parenting level one. I feel like he has never met his other child. Whatever, that's his prerogative. Oh yeah, I said it was really dark in here. Okay, I'm gonna go around and add some more lights to this place, like in here, as well as in this room. It's ridiculously dark. Maybe in here as well. There we go, much better. All right, we're going with the cake and can I add an event right now while you're doing that? We might as well. All right, let's get the birthday party. We have pretty much at this point nailed the birthday party. Like we start the party and we're already at bronze, which is pretty sweet. So let's do this again. <gasps> oh no, 
Cobalt. Okay. It's Indigo's birthday tomorrow. I can't. <gasps> Willow Adams. Oh no, her name changed. We have to change her name back to Moon. The name Moon needs to last all 10 generations of the challenge. I don't care. The last name is Moon and that is that. Okay, guests, since I forgot to invite everyone to our wedding. I can't believe I did that. Like, can you believe that? I've never done that before. Uh, let's invite, no, actually let's not invite Martin. Addison, yeah, it's mostly just gonna be our family and we have a big family, so there's gonna be a lot of people. I think everyone that I'm invite inviting is family. Ooh, Robin and Willow, I think that was everyone. Oh, should I? Uh, guys, I think I should invite Daniel. Like it's his child's birthday. Like his, his kid, Cobalt, is turning into like a young adult, not an actual young adult, but like a teenager. I think, I feel like he should be here. Okay, and that's good to go. I guess we're just gonna have it here. Yeah, cause people can see our new Renos as well right now. Hello, why can't I click? Invite all the required rules. What do you mean? I literally clicked on him. All right, there we go. Birthday celebrants need a cake. I'm literally baking a cake right now, game. Shut up. <laughs> Sorry, I was swallowing. If she just changed into a party outfit, girl. Girl, no, no. Why is this your party outfit? That is so distressing. This is a party outfit. Ah, who's up here? Whoa, why is this? Why, are, why? You know, why don't we not go to our are, child's room and hang out downstairs? Indigo, what are you doing? She's so sad, it's making me sad. Cobalt, you don't need to socialize with the random strangers who walk into your room, just saying. All right, oh, mama. Hi, oh, she doesn't look very good. Yeah, mom, what kind of makeup trends are you following these days? And also, what are you taking? Uh -huh. Yeah, okay. So I think our mom is sick. I don't, oh, here's everyone. I, oh my God, oh, thank God no one took a piece of that. No, not you, not you, not you. No, wrong people. Ah, panic, panic, panic. Add, 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 birthday candles. Okay. Oh my God, Lily. I love how she's still rocking this outfit and she is still rocking it. Okay, there we go. See, look, we're literally already at bronze. We're going to hold our Bubba. Okay, let's let Cobalt age up. Does he have any friends? <laughs> That's so sad, but what does he? Diego, Diego, oh Diego, that's his like cousin, isn't it? Is he here? Oh, why did that just change? Is Diego here? Oh, he's right here. Oh my God, you could have a friend. Oh, I remember Diego. Ask for advice, moan about new sibling. Come be friends with your, I think, cousin. Enthuse about candy. You guys need to be best friends. Let's just ask him about his day, get to know him a little bit. Cute. Okay, I realized I did say I was gonna age him up, but let's let them talk for a minute and then we'll age him up. I wonder when Diego ages up. Actually, I can look. If I go MC, oh, he's on day seven out of seven as well. So either today or tomorrow. I don't know how that works. No, 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 no. Oh my God. Oh my God, what do I do? Call. Call someone! No, don't cock! <laughs> oh my god! Ow, my ears, why are they so loud? It's sick, call fire department, do something! Hello? Hello, Cobalt, how did you get over there? Why are my headphones so freaking loud? Cobalt, get out of there. Ooh. Oh, we do have the thing. Do we have the thing? Yes, we do. See, this is why we have this thing. <gasps> We got so yeah. much money. That was a brand new stove. Huh. We literally just got yeah. that stove. I just want to point out. Uh, mm, okay, so aspiration completed. <laughs> oh, good. Was that an event? Was our fire, no, was our kitchen catching on fire an event game? How dare you? And game, I'm literally throwing him a party. Wait, or just, that's not you. Okay, but wait, guys, we did it. We did, what is going on in here? No, oh, stop, Adeline. All right, well, good thing, I guess, is our aspiration is complete. Um, Cobalt, come blow out your candles. How many fires has this household had now? Or just like this challenge so far, like four? All right, here we go. We're here to celebrate. Yay. Yeah, like the fire never happened. <gasps> Woo! Ooh, he got a bonus trait. Whoa, that's cool. He got romance too? Because for some reason. Cool. All right, so his random trait 
three, two, one. <gasps> good. He's a good genius. He's not an evil genius. Guys, he's a good genius. <gasps> I just realized, remember first generation? We couldn't have someone age up or meet a sim that wasn't evil or mean. I think we may have turned the tides, turned the tables around because he is a good genius. Oh, that makes me happy. All right, as for his aspiration, do I go off of the good genius thing or do I do, do I do random? I don't know. Oh, oh I forgot about the teen ones. I like picking a teen one. Um, I don't know, maybe this one goal oriented. The sim wants to be the best. Grades, check. Sports, check. Money, check. Well, not really. I feel like these are all kind of popular ones, like admired drama llama. I'm just gonna do this one, the goal oriented. It seems the most like hit. Oh, well, that was interesting. So apparently when you age up, you also change your race. Okay, I'm gonna assume. I mean, okay, but I'm, oh, his dad sent him a gift. His dad is here though, isn't he? Azur is very hungry. Okay, let's go eat her up. I have some CC, like custom content that is like skin overlays and some of them actually change like, like fully go over your skin. So I'm guessing that's what's happened here. So let's go up to little baby Azur here. She looks a lot more tan because Duck is pretty tan. Oh, and look at that gold, of course. Oh, okay, do you know what, Duck? Let's let him age her up. Age up. Go ahead, Ducky boy. Are you gonna do? Oh, you are, okay. Yay! As her age up. Okay, so her trait, three, two, one. <gasps> sunny, oh my god, Indigo was sunny as well. Isn't that funny? First time, little Bubba's had the same trait. All right, and we know the drill straight into Cass. Okay, so let's first look at Cobalt here. He's got quite a lot going on. So first, I wanna see, yeah, there's definitely a skin overlay on him. I'm gonna go into face, just remove, yeah. Remove all of this, accessories, all of that. Look at our handsome boy. He looks so much like Willow. Look at his profile. Cause Willow has like a bit more of a flatter nose like that. Wow, his profile is literally Willow. Okay, I'm gonna put some CC on him and I will be right back. Okay guys, so I haven't done his clothes yet, but I just put some CC on him and oh my gosh, look at him. He's a handsome little feller. I still don't know what is going on with the eyelashes. Like I might need to re-download all of my eyelashes. I don't know if it's the game or the CC, but I pointed this out before, but the eyelashes are like outside of the eyes almost. Like they're not in the right spot, but I still think he looks better with them than without them. So I still gave him, gave them to him. I gave him this symbiont overlay. It just looks so good on him. I usually give this cartoony skin. You can see it, it's very like flat very maxis match but something about this one just added dimension to him and oh, it just works so well i also gave him cc eyebrows which i think are what and this hair is from growing together because he's always had kind of longer swept back hair i think this looks so handsome look at our little boy growing up all right brb again i'm gonna give him some new little clothes while still trying to keep him teenager-esque because i hate when our teenagers look like adults okie dokie and here he is this is his every day now looking at it it's pretty plain and boring i wanted to give him kind of like a gamer just kind of plain teeny graphic tee this was honestly the best one or maybe this one is actually more gamer yeah you know, i'm gonna go with this one all the other ones up top were like really baggy and i didn't like them so this one's fine i'm trying to figure out why all of these shirts have like a yellow border around them i have no idea why but anyways his formal just nice simple plain no nothing crazy not like a full suit or anything athletic same his style is pretty basic i don't know just kind of plain simple hmm. boyish stuff sleep just a cozy little gray sleepy outfit with the little bunny slippers party little polo with some shorts i like these shorts swimwear just some trunks i don't know if we'll see all this stuff because it just turned spring but whatever hot weather i did use the styled looks for hot weather and cold weather i don't mind this one i like it i like the, that uh, green color and cold weather as well i don't think i've ever used any of these pieces like this jacket's actually quite nice so 
and there we are. Ooh. And now next, if we move to little Azur, oh my god, look at her tan, y'all. I mean, I knew Duck was tan, but oh my god, look at her. We got a tan little blue-eyed Bubba, loving it. All right, let's remove some of this stuff. She has her little ears pierced. Wow, she is like gray. Okay, she actually has gray hair. <laughs> I just realized that Duck has gray hair, so that's where she probably got the gray hair. But, um, yeah, his natural hair obviously was not gray. So I'm gonna guess that maybe she has, like, black hair. I feel like that makes the most sense. I feel like maybe Duck had, like, black hair. If Willow did not have blue hair, her hair would be black. So let's go with black hair for little Azur. But the blue eyes are so cool, don't you think? Okay, so there really wasn't much for CC for her face. I just put a little overlay on it just to kind of smooth out her features, but that's really it. And her hair, I don't know if you can tell, she has textured hair, which is really exciting. We haven't had textured hair since Willow. Willow has textured hair, but none of her kids do. But now, Azur does, and this is honestly the only textured hair that she grew up with besides this really uh, short one, which isn't bad either. But I think this one that she grew up with or aged up with is really cute. So I'm going to keep that on her. And now I'm going to go in and pick some little outfits for her. So I will be right back again. All right. So that was pretty quick. She's going to be this age for a day or two. I'm obsessed with, I don't know why, oh, voice crack. I don't know why when they age up as sunny, I just have this inkling, this urge to dress them in yellow. So I give her a yellow top. Look at how cute that is. I don't think I've ever, ever used this top. It's some little black and uh, pink polka dot little leggings. And I also can't get away from these stinking adorable little monster booties. So I gave her those too. Formal wear. Look at this little dress. It has little clouds on it. Sleepy wear. I thought this was just the cutest. I think they're oranges, but the colors of this looks so nice with her skin tone party wear oh my god how have i never used this it's base game like is this new this is the cutest little outfit i love the details on the shoulders there's so many really cute swatches with that little b hot weather oh i didn't realize it's actually the same outfit but now with the strawberry on it i don't even care that they're the same and then cold weather just a simple little yellowy orange um what is this called onesie thing it's literally pretty much the only option for toddlers or infants it's cute it does the job i don't think we'll see this because it's spring now but there we go there is azur little baby and mr cobalt oh yeah he's cute he's cute oh there she is mama has come up to see her oh look at them pause let's get an adorable picture Oh, look at them. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, God. What am I doing? No. Go. Oh. What? Hello? I think. There we go. I was trying to do that. But that's too high. Play. I yeah. want. I want Willow to look at her. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, what is she doing? Bro. Okay, that's adorable. Don't what is all this? Ew. Okay. That's gross. So the party is bumping down here. Look at everyone. Oh, there's Cobalt. Our handsome boy. Where's your dad? Sunny and Yeah, yeah, yeah. Isn't... I thought... We invited him. Oh, my God. Look! How did the fire go through the wall? Are you joking? Replace that. That's not too bad. Honestly, I forgot about the fire. Okay. So... Oh, my God. This is going to be so expensive. Thank God we got some decent money. Oh, yeah. We cannot afford to replace our stove. And of course, it was brand new. <sighs> okay, that's fine. I don't want to replace it now anyways, because people are just going to try to cook things again and probably set my house on fire for a second time today. So I'm not going to do that. Wow, it is a mess in here. But I like how everyone is actually talking and mingling and eating and stuff. That's really nice. Where did Azur go? How did you get put in there? Oh, wait, Daniel is here. You know what? It's been wonderful to spend time with you. We've made some great memories and we'll make many more, I'm sure of it. Oh, wow. Cobalt said that about Daniel. Oh, there he is. Okay, I didn't even make them do this. That is kind of nice that they're chatting. All right, so while, ew, oh my God. They're, why are there disgusting diapers everywhere? So, um, yeah, since she aged up, I am gonna squish her in with indigo just for now. Then maybe when indigo ages up, which is tomorrow, maybe, maybe we'll have enough money when Willow gets home to like add on a bedroom. 
hopefully that would be cool but for now i'm gonna have the little girls split in this room which is fine i still have this heirloom crib that was indigo's and it's a little bit tight a wee bit toyed in here but if i do that scoot this little guy in that corner i think that's fine may have to scoot that a little bit more yeah that should work lovely oh yay birthday party complete that is right and look at that we didn't get any of our skills up and it's almost time for bed for tomorrow who's surprised not me i'm gonna pause and see if i can get my charisma skill up at this party this should be the easiest place to get my charisma skill everyone brighten everyone's day what else can we do um only brighten day what do you mean okay i guess we're only brighten brightening his day everyone's leaving oh shoot okay cobalt hello can i brighten your day who else's day can i brighten is anyone even why are you on the floor now you're in there okay so you yeah you can also go home is that aria aria diego you guys can probably go not to be rude oh my god look at how close she is did you see that she's so close to leveling up her charisma i gotta do it i gotta do it why are these options so hard to find oh here we go compliment outfit it's in friendly compliments there's a couple charisma options no now she's not listening now she's going to play with her baby i mean that's good but also can you just listen to me for once are yet you gotta go go away and diego he's actually been cleaning up which is really cute but babes you gotta go home Wait, you too why haven't you gone home send home y'all these two are being cute but like what about our charisma school flatter your husband compliment your husband no compliment him flatter him what are you having that looks yummy oatmeal did you do it oh my god oh look at that look at that okay brighten his day and then this should get it okay yes okay we did one thing we're not gonna have them all ready for uh, work tomorrow, but whatever. Okay, I'm gonna get everyone's skills up decently. Sun, uh, Cobalt, why are you using our brand new shower? You have one. No, you don't actually, you don't. Okay, fine, fine, fair enough. His room is also very childish. Next episode, we will upgrade his bedroom a little bit and then also try to add on a new bedroom, which maybe he might want to move into, actually. Little baby, get in bed. Oh my God. Actually, get into your bed, please. Okay, wait, what's that? Where are you? Oh, you are in your bed. Okay. Phew. Now go to sleep, please. And then we can make time fly. Go to sleep, little baby. She's happy. She's such a good little baby. <gasps> I forgot Duck has his little part-time job. I think he starts at five, so he's at first P. Cutie. I think he only works for a couple of hours, but oh, look at him. Off to his little, uh, what is he, a barista? Off he goes. What a cute little elder. Hey, what are you guys doing out here? Are you not freezing? Oh, God, that scared me. Okay, so Doc is back. He made 78 simoleons. I'm just getting him to feed little Bubba Zer. What's broken? Hang on. Okay, that's broken. Oh, do you know what? No, I shouldn't replace it. Okay, do you know what? That's going to stay like that for now. Cobalt is off to his first day of high school. I should probably wake Willow up to eat and then maybe try to get another one of her skills up before work. Oh my god, the house is still trashed. Oh my god, our bills. $2,400. I completely forgot about bills. Oh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> so we can't do a room right now, but hopefully after Will gets back from work today, we can pay those bills and then save up for an additional room. Okay, I think I'm going to end this here. Unfortunately, guys, I do have to get going. But next episode is going to be Indigo's birthday. Yeah, we'll try to expand the house, upgrade Cobalt's room. All that fun stuff. Hopefully, maybe get Willow a promotion. Actually, I shouldn't say that. I'm just gonna jinx it. Um, no. And we still have to, excuse me, replace our stupid stove that's stupid and broken. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure to leave a comment for suggestions for the series and other one-off challenges. And I will see y'all in the next one. Bye!